bringing three of our passions together in one project was pretty amazing. Motorcycling, gaming and computing were the building blocks of the fastest cyber Apache. Our love for photography and cinematography is just the icing on the cake. Hi, my name is Sunny, also known as Emotographer. I represent XBHP, which was India's first motorcycling social media network found in 2002 and is still the most popular motorcycling platform in India. Apart from riding and shooting motorcycles around the world and catalyzing the motorcycling community in India, we've always set out to do things that have never been done before. The idea was very simple, to create a motorcycle themed ultra fast gaming rig. This was even more exciting as it was a completely uncharted territory. Never been done before in India and tried by very few around the world. Frankly, we were very surprised to know that given the common elements of thrill and speed associated with motorcycling and computing and gaming, but happy at the same time as it would give us the opportunity to set the wheels rolling and hopefully others will get inspired by us to do the same. The TVS Apache RR310 was the unanimous choice to base the build on. It is fast, beautiful and completely made in India. One of the best two wheelers to come out of India. The next piece of the puzzle were the components. We chose to go with the Republic of Gamers or ROG from ASUS given their expertise and passion for gaming. The ROG Strix LC2 360 CPU cooler, the ROG Strix X570E gaming motherboard, the ROG Strix RTX 3080 Ti OC graphics card and the ROG Thor 1200W Platinum. That coupled with 64GB of Trident G-Skill Z Neo RAM tuned for the AMD Ryzen and 2TB of XPG Gamex 570 storage. For the CPU, we chose the AMD Ryzen 9 5950X with 16 cores, 32 threads with 3.4 GHz base clock and 4.9 GHz boost. The base case to bring all these components together would be the Tough Gaming GT501 case. Next step was to get the right people on board. We got Deepak Bansal, also known as the model artisan, to implement the build in his workshop. He's a petrol head as well, so that made things easier. Hi, I'm Deepak Bansal, also known as model artisan. As we are presenting this marvelous piece of engineering now, I would say, a combination of art and engineering here and a lot of expertise have gone in this. It's always a pleasure in working with the XBHP. You can see it's a motorcycle with a computer inside, which is a very, I mean, amazing, super fast computer. We had mixed many technologies, many ideas into one thing, but it was ultimately a good learning experience. And then now you can see what has come up. Karan Singh Bansata, who takes care of the XBHP print magazine, was the one who would assemble the components and bring his dry humor to the table. Ramandeep, our longtime friend and an amazing electronics wizard, will be giving the Cyber Apache some nifty little tricks. We followed a hybrid process of 3D printing and clay modeling to get the basic shell made and then started adding layers of complexities. Gulving doors to show off the build were one of the toughest to build with the precision cutting of the fairing hinge design and correct placement of the linear actuators with remote control operation. We also managed to source an external monitor which matched the size of the actual Apache RR310 console and used the IDA64 software to create our own console that would give real-time readouts. We also used the actual handle assembly from the bike but modded the thumb starter button to switch on the build. Some other additions were the replicating of seats, adding a USB port under the fuel cap and creating the frame that will hold our build to resemble that of the real motorcycle. Lighting was one of the most important parts of the build. As a photographer, I know that best. Getting to replicate the front and rear of the build to match the actual bike was a bit tricky, but we did manage to pull that off in the end. We 
also added some underbody smart LED strips as well. Plus all the build components were addressable RGB with Aura Sync. So that was perfect. Then there were the glowing TVS and ROG insignias coupled with the right kind of paint and decals on the bike to give it that final finished look. At XBHP, we put the biker above the bike and continuing that philosophy, we had to make a custom rider mannequin racer and of course, safety is of paramount importance as well. Therefore, we had it on a helmet as well. Part of the motorcycle experience is sound as well and therefore, Ramadeep also made us a contraption that sounds off the moment the rig gets electricity. And here is how it sounds. Welcome to the fastest cyber Apache. So finally, after months of work and a lot of learning along the way, I present to you ADS first of its kind, the fastest cyber Apache. Isn't that super cool? But what is a gaming rig without playing a little bit on it? And here's where we are going to level up a few notches. The Apache R310 is essentially a racing bike. So what better than to have a racing and simulation cockpit from one of the best companies in the world who know the business. Say hello to next level racing FGT cockpit. Used by thousands of professional drivers and eSport teams, it has dual position cockpits to have you in authentic Formula or GT racing positions. I hope they also make a simulator for motorcycles as well. But for the moment, it's going to be like this. Last but not the least, to complete the setup, we need a monitor. But hold on, we are not doing anything conventional here. So let me present to you one of the finest gaming projectors in the world, the BenQ TK700ST short throw 4K projector. This can project up to 200 inches of 4K goodness with 4K 60 Hz at 16 milliseconds input lag. 1080p at 120 Hz at 8 milliseconds and 1080 240Hz at 4 milliseconds. It's 3000 lumens and it also has a 5 watt chamber speaker, which means that we only need a portable screen to set everything up. So guys, I'm so excited uh, to bring you this, the fastest Cyber Apache. This is like a dream come true. And I hope that you know you really enjoyed this. As always, ride safe, game hard, and just do whatever you want to do. Just put your heart into it, your soul into it. I just love doing this project.